excited about this next segment. Very fun. Theater is so fun. I love everything about theater. I've only done a little smidgen of theater. But you've done some important little theater. I have, at age three. Yeah. I, I did my movie debut at age three. And then my career just went down from there. So but then when you were 25, <laughs> you perked up a little bit. I did. I did okay. a little bit of, you know, Sound of Music. I was Maria in a community play. Nice. If you'd like me to sing you some opera right now, I, I'd be happy to. But maybe, later. maybe we'll later. Save it. We'll save it for another segment <laughs> because we've got some guests. I am so excited about our guests. Our guests are from the Theater Guild, and it's Sandy O'Connor and Artie Rosenstein. Thank you so much for coming today. We're thrilled to have you. We're excited to be Our here. Our pleasure. Yeah, thank you so much. So tell us a little bit first about Theater Guild. Okay, Theater Guild's been around since the 60s, actually, here in Laguna Woods. That's awesome. And so I, I think it's one of the oldest clubs. And uh, we have about 200 members and very active. Our goal primarily is musicals and plays. And the plays tend to be on the lighter, funnier side. Mm. And the musicals tend to be a cast of thousands. Oh, yeah. And wow. uh, so, I mean, we usually have very large casts. And uh, so we really have a lot of fun. And at our meetings, we try to do our best to involve the members and have them participate so that we can grow people into wanting to perform or work backstage or do makeup or costumes or whatever. I love so that's that. sort that of how wonderful. we work. And our theme is involve and evolve. Well, and I love that you bring everybody in because we all want to be part of like a great production, right? You know, we have so everybody loves theater, yeah. right? And it doesn't matter if you're like doing the makeup, like you say, or production and sound. There's something for everyone. And I think it's nice to have drama in your life that actually isn't your life. It's exactly. nice to be part of somebody else's drama. <laughs> that's <laughs> right, that's right. What's the best play that you've done, personally? Favorite. Favorite. <clears throat> Artie? Well, the best thing that I've ever done in theater, and it's very different than this show here, uh, there was a Shakespeare on the patio, which was snippets mm -hmm. from Shakespeare plays, and I got to play Shylock from uh, The Merchant of Venice. Oh, wow. that's fabulous. But this, on the other hand, is a comedy and it's a very funny play so this is the play that's coming up right right on june 15th and i would say for my part because of the part i have this could end up being my favorite i'll find out when okay. it's all said really and done. but i have to play a very ditzy blonde who nothing ever goes Cast right against type of course <laughs> of course and the thing is is that it's so funny and I, everything goes wrong in my life I'm, things are always happening to me so bottom line if it all works out the way i hope it does it will probably be my favorite but the musicals have been so much fun so much fun and we have so many people in them and it's just been great so tell us a little bit more about the play love lies in the doctor's dilemma it sounds provocative the pictures look provocative <laughs> it looks like it's going to be a really great show Okay. Well, thank you. you and I tell think we've got Artie and Drag up here, and uh, oh, you gave need, away my secret. We need to know more. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's a show about white lies turning, making, adding up one after the other, mm -hmm. and and trying to keep the thing together. And it's a farce. It's one of these shows where people are going in one door and out the other, mm -hmm. and just missing the timing, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. and. But it's really been the funniest show, the most enjoyable show for me, as far as, as the rehearsals. Mm -hmm. I and mean, we've had to stop rehearsals how many times, Sandy? Because somebody cracks up. <laughs> <laughs> and that's our whole goal now is quit laughing at our own show. And just right. get through and, and the <laughs> audience to laugh at Yeah, the we want the audience to laugh. So, and, and the other fun part is, ironically, uh, when it was cast, we've all worked together before. Oh, how fun. Oh, so Artie great. has been my husband in two shows. He's my boyfriend in this show. Okay. Um, another gentleman, John Kelsell, I've been in shows with. But every one of us has worked together, right. you know, in other shows. And it's really nice because the friendships that we already have, I think, have enhanced our, our uh, camaraderie mm -hmm. and our fun that we're having in this show. That's mm. great. That's so great. And it was explained to me that it was kind of Shakespeare meets the Marx Brothers. So it sounds like you can't do anything that isn't going to be fun exactly. in this combination. Exactly. I mean, if you like Shakespeare, go. If you like Marx Brothers, go. If you like anywhere in between right? those two <laughs> opposite ends of the spectrum, go. <laughs> right? <Please> go. <laughs> and I know that the first act is when a playwright does the right job, they have set everything up in the first act. Mm -hmm. And then the second act, of course, I would call it explodes into the true craziness of the whole story. Mm -hmm. And so that's that's what's really fun. And, and based on all the antics, we have to do a lot of rehearsing 
very minutely each farcical scene mm -hmm. because eventually it has to come together and be very fast. So that's been an interesting challenge. Interesting. I bet. Well, this sounds like it's going to be a great play. And I have just a couple of questions for you before we go about the Theater Guild in general. So it seems like to be a very inclusive organization. What do we do if we want to sign up or if we want to participate? Like, how do we get a hold of you guys? Well, there's a couple of ways to do that. Um, one is to go to the lagunawoodsvillage.com website and go to clubs and go to Theater Guild. And in there are our names, contact people like mm -hmm. myself mm -hmm. and others to contact. Sandy's being modest. She happens to be the president. Okay. Oh, okay, well then. <laughs> Call Sandy. Okay. <laughs> or if you see her on the street, just stop her. Right. And, um, and we... Uh, so that's how you do it. And, and actually, people do call me, and they have called others, mm -hmm. uh, to find out more mm -hmm. about us. So, And we're in the Globe. When all of our meetings mm -hmm. are in the Globe. Okay. So this encourages, and we always encourage guests so okay. that they come and check us out and see how we are. Is there anything that we need to do, like a soliloquy or a Shakespeare or anything to try out, or you just come and Not unless you want to. See, that's okay. part of the... You come and you enjoy. If you feel like, okay, gee whiz, I think I want to try this, the meetings provide an atmosphere where you can do that. And th like right now uh, in June, we're doing a barbecue, but we're also doing conversations in cars. Mm -hmm. oh. And this will be when you get together with four people and you create um, a conversation based on a song. Oh, how fun. Right. That and so fun. we'll be doing that. And we've done improvs and we've done one act plays and uh, we've had people who are in our group that are musical. We've done musical things. But the main thing is, is to just make people feel that they can come and have a good time. Mm -hmm. And then mo in most cases, a, a good percentage will start to get involved after a period of time, okay. if not right away. And they don't have to have a history in theater. They don't have to have acted no, or I mean, done I, any background. This, this is my 16th play. Okay. And before getting involved in Laguna Woods Village, I hadn't done anything since the senior play in high school. So you don't have to have a, an extensive theater background. Okay. You just have to have the willingness to get in there and, and grow. Got it. Do you have a theater okay. background, Sandy? Mm, very little. I did a lot in high school. Mm -hmm. I did community theater. But when I came to Laguna Woods, it had been 30 years mm -hmm. since I had done any theater at all. And I auditioned for the first show, got on, and, and that was the end of it. I was, was going to be in as much as I can. But one of our wonderful actresses in the show, Eveline Hoffman, she had never done anything, period, zero, zip until she decided to audition for a show in Laguna Woods, and she's been in so many of our shows. Wow. Oh, that sounds That's so That's so great. great. What a great opportunity. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, I hope a lot of the residents will take advantage of it. And the and tickets are on sale. Okay. Mm -hmm. Tickets are on June sale. 15, 16, and how do we get the, do we still, how do we go to the website again, Laguna Woods Village? Well, actually, you go to the box office in the okay. Performing Arts Center and buy your tickets, but it's also on our website. Okay. Okay. Also so they can buy it. them online? Um, no, they oh, cannot. Okay. They do need to go to the box office, but it's June 15, 16, 17th, Friday and Saturday are 7, Sunday is at 2, and tickets are 12 and 15, and uh, we have a huge poster in the lobby there so we can hopefully have people that aren't, don't know about it that much, mm -hmm. we'll see that, and we also have flyers in, in the clubhouses so people can and see the flyer looks like this. Yes. Perfect. Exactly. And they know what to look for. Yep. Excellent. Thank you Great. so much for being with us. Yeah, thank you so much. This was thank so you. I think fun. we need to go. Let's get our let's tickets. Stay. Oh, no, let's oh, stay. We need to go see the show. We do need no, to, we don't need to come and see the show, show for sure. I just have like 10 more questions, but I know we are out of time. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to go see the show. Good. And then we'll have you back afterwards. And then we'll have you back to talk about the post show. Oh, good. Okay. <laughs> or the, the reviews. One. The reviews. The, the next show. The standing ovation. The, of course. All of yes. Of yes. course. All of it. All right. Thank you. We'll be right back. That was so fun. You were good, Artie. See?